What an interesting, interesting concept. I'm, I believe that, uh, have y'all got any projections as to, um, how big you're going to get and how quick, cause you're growing pretty fast. They, they don't make computer programs strong. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, it's, uh, you know, we're, I mean, we're very ambitious. You know, we started this company with the idea that it, it has to be big. You know, we wanted to build this thing into a nationwide, uh, company that helps hundreds of thousands of people. So there's, you know, no way, no way about it. Today, we're primarily located in the Southeast. We're kind of Texas through Florida, through kind of Virginia and a little bit in the Midwest. Um, we'd like to be coast to coast. Uh, again, we're over 2,500 units today. Uh, we'd like to be 10,000 by the end of next year. You know, that's, uh, we're, in our mind, we should be, there's such an enormous unmet need for this product in the market. And we joke a lot of times, uh, obviously our, our marketing team does wonderful things to find folks and scream and get them through that funnel. But, you know, if we added 10,000 units tomorrow, you know, they'd panic a bit, but we could fill them, you know, because there's, uh, for better or for worse, just an enormous shortage of affordable units in the country. So really we're in a, we're in a supply constrained uh, market and which is why we're, you know, enjoying opportunities like this to reach out to investors who are interested in solving a problem and also want to get paid for it. You know, they want, they want to generate a yield, you know, they, as they should as investors. So uh, we came at this from a real estate investor focus. That's our backgrounds. And uh, you know, so we know that that part of it has to work. So if a real estate investor that's uh, listening to the show here has got, you know, some houses or a portfolio of houses, or they just want to, you know, take a look at converting some of their houses is, is part of the service that pad split offers is actually uh, helping the real estate investor market their houses and find uh, renters for this usage. Exactly. That is, uh, that's really our core offering. So um, again, similar to the way to think about it is similar to Airbnb in that they're listed on our platform, but we do all of the marketing and lease up for the properties to get people moved in and booked. And we do all of the screening and background check, credit check, income verification, employment verification, all that's done and, and part of the process. Gotcha. So you act, so pad split actually, uh, actually makes the decision for the real estate investor as to whether this person should be accepted as a renter or not. Right. Right. We do that upfront screening. Yep. Gotcha. And y'all collect the money. That's correct. We do. And we run all of the collections. So if people are behind or late fees, we do all that. And, and the way to think about it is uh, if you have that house, that's seven bedrooms, we build weekly because again, one of our early insights in the way that we, we built the business was a lot of landlords aren't very customer focused, right? You bill on the first because it's easy for your lender. It's easy for your, uh, you know, it's easy for the bank. It's easier for your accounting mm -hmm. team. Uh, but it isn't that easy for renters, right? Because, you know, today, what day is it? Okay. Well, I know that it's Tuesday. When's Friday. Okay. I get paid on Friday. I get billed on Friday, but when's the first of the month? I have no idea. Um, so it's all about making it simple for people to pay. And we, you know, we work through, it's all electronic payments, but auto pay features and all that. But the idea is how do you have more of a customer focus to make it as easy as possible? But again, weekly payments, seven bedrooms, you know, you might have 30 some payments in a month, we kind of bundle it all up together and then remit it in one easy payment uh, to the landlord. So that again, it's easy for accounting, easy for your lender, that kind of thing. Well, when you got a renter that's not paying, who gets them out? <laughs> <laughs> in, in many cases, we're able to do that remotely through our customer service team. And we, we have those conversations when it's, because again, it, it happens, right? Especially in the pandemic and all sorts of things going on, you know, job churn is real. Uh, but if it comes down to it occasionally, it does, does come to a formal eviction process, uh, unfortunately, when things, when things go south. So, well, the yeah. good news is since you're collecting weekly, if there's a problem, you're going to know it a lot sooner than collecting monthly. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. 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 We, we're definitely on top of people. It's not, they don't trust me with it at Pat Split. I'm, uh, I don't know, uh, maybe, maybe too nice, but, uh, or not tenacious enough, but they, uh, we have a team that's really, you know, keeps on top of people all the time. Right. Well, another, another cool thing about billing weekly is like, if you're just, if you're just uh, collecting monthly, well, some months I've got four weeks and some months I've got five weeks. And so yeah. it's like, 
you have like a, a built in, maybe a little extra revenue thing there on the weeks that months that's got five weeks. Exactly. I'm glad you picked up on that because I don't know how many times I've, uh, I've worked with folks who are like, why is this month uh, less than that month? You know, what, what went wrong? And you're like, well, there's, there's four weeks, you know, four <laughs> Sundays this month as opposed to five, you know, it's just, uh, it's the nature of it. So you're, yeah, you're already, you're already set up to be a passable host.